Okay, what we got is uh, basically a piece of wood that has shrunk. Uh, when they sell these, these are wet so that you can put nails in them and after a while they shrink. So now because it's shrinking, it's creating problem. And I see some attempts here to fix the problem, but apparently it didn't work. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a piece of wood like this underneath and we're going to nail it to it. So two nails will, this will be held like that and we're going to drive the nail. It's going to be basically our fix. Two of them, one on the bottom, one on the top. The tool I'm using, uh, I did not have to remove this fence if I wanted to work on the other side, but it's too far for me to go around. It was easier to take the fence yeah, somebody had uh, put a screw in, take the screw out. It took like two minutes. Uh, the tool you need is, uh, this was, uh, this drives like a two and a half inch gun. Uh, put it at like a hundred pounds of pressure there. Uh, I bought this from eBay for a hundred dollars, just a gun. And then I bought the pump. It came with a couple other items, I think around $200 uh, if you live in the U.S. Uh, those are the prices, so looking to refurbish uh, be a good option. So we're going to go ahead and shoot the gun. Kind of loud. It sounds like a real gun. <laughs> but, and that's why they call it nail gun. So anyway, let's get started. <laughs> it doesn't have to be a perfect job, believe me. They will hold. These nails are strong. You get the idea. Alrighty, we're done. Put the fence back together. We're gonna do the top and we we consider it done, okay? We're gonna have to do a perfect job, okay? Because the electricity is far away and I didn't want to go charge the gun, some of these nails are not all the way in. So you just help them out. Now if you notice, it's not moving really. It's 
pretty good. And you can you can use your hammer to help out the gun. That's it. We're done.